Hello guys, today I'm going to talk about this situation. Sometimes you may be installing Windows in your laptop computer and something like this happens. So when it happens, don't panic. You're supposed to think about uh, three things. Number one, it could be the hard disk failure. Sometimes hard disk can fail and because of that, it can fail to, to be recognized. It can, it can fail to show up here. And for this reason, you are supposed to remove that hard disk and then replace it with another one. Secondly, it could be the computer hard disk is not properly placed within the computer. So what you are supposed to do is remove that hard disk and then try to reinsert it again in the computer and then try to install the windows again. Or the third option could be because the windows you are trying to install within this computer uh, some of the drivers are missing so in this case when something like this happens you are supposed to come here and then you close and then it will bring you back here to install the window and here you'll be able to press shift and then f10 on your keyboard press shift and f10 on your keyboard so once you have done this, you are supposed now to type disk part. And then click enter. So once you do that, it means that you are supposed to proceed to the next level. And then you, uh, you type list. disk enter so in this situation you will see the available disk within this machine here so if your disk is available you are, you can be able to see in that table there then you can uh, press uh, this option whereby you say select disk zero select disk zero then you enter they say disk zero is now selected then you are supposed to you are supposed to type clean and then you enter so they are saying disk part succeeded in cleaning uh, the disk. So once this is done, you are supposed to exit. And then you close this black window you are seeing. So you can now uh, click install or you can restart your machine and then try to install the windows again trust me this problem will uh, be solved once and for all just think of what i have just told you and trust me it will be over and you'll be able to continue installing your windows without any problem if you have any uh, any question just put it in a comment section i'll be able to answer you